In this video, I'll show you how to automatically add or insert gaps between subtitle lines in Subtitle Edit. This is an answer video and welcome to this video. Now, uh, this is uh, following an email I received. Hi David, uh, and this is somebody who watches my Subtitle Edit tutorials. And the issue is uh, I have received a subtitle file, not done with Subtitle Edit, and there's no time gap between subtitles. So it looks like this. So you can see like uh, the numbering and then we have the subtitle uh, and then we have the text and then the space. So what I want you guys to check out is the number that ends here is still the number that or the time code is the one that ends here is the one that begins here. So uh, it's like that uh, all through. Uh, so it looks something like that. If you scroll down, you can still see something of that sort here. You still get it here here you get it here and if we actually scroll down again and and so on for hundreds of subtitles so you see that the ending time of each subtitle is the same as the starting point of the next one so that's the issue uh, I would like to know if there's a way to automatically insert a couple of frames between each subtitle with subtitle edit I've seen your video telling how to change or set up so that there are two frames when you create your subtitles but I don't see anything to change spacing between subtitles once they are all created. Can you help? So uh, that's the issue. Uh, I believe I've never had to deal with such a situation, but I think this is the solution that you kind of uh, want for that. And I've actually copied uh, th that particular text and placed it uh, right inside here uh, in subtitle edit. So you can see the end time is the beginning time. The end time is the beginning time. Uh, the only one that had a slight difference was this one. Uh, where that is not the case but when you look at this the start time is the same the end time the start time for the next line is the same so i feel it's pretty simple uh click on one line press on control a i don't think it's necessary go to tools and then you'll see apply minimum gap between subtitles and when i click on that uh minimum uh, milliseconds between lines 24 uh, it gives you the frame rate, uh, kind of frame rate. Uh, if you know what frame rate you're working with, uh, then you can choose for that video that is. And then two frames and two frames uh, at 23.976 frames per second is 83 milliseconds. If I change this to something like 60, it gives you 33. So really depends on the video frame rate that you're going to work with. Uh, but let's assume you want to add like four frames or whatever. Uh, really depends. Uh, but you can already see here, uh, it's kind of doing away with this one, probably because of the way things look like. Let's go back to two and see. Uh, let's say, okay. And once you do that, you can already see that the times have changed. So the times no longer conflict like the ending and the start time. Uh, so my thought process is that this is what uh, Jonathan wants. Uh, that's the answer like they're looking for. I've never tried it. I've never been in such a position, but I, I hope it's what you're looking for. Uh, I think there's something else I saw. Bridge gaps between subtitles. So uh, a gap to the next, uh, to next in seconds. So I think you can also kind of use this. Uh, but I think I'd probably go with the apply minimum gap between subtitles. So uh, I hope this answers your question on how to automatically add or insert gaps between subtitle lines in subtitle edit. Thanks for asking.